purpose of this tutorial is to demonstrate the use and functionality of iGantt Optimizer for short-term up to long-term detailed scheduling for OpenPIP applications. The scenario used for this tutorial is an OpenPIP project for basic load and haul activity scheduling with locations within multiple pits, pushbacks and benches down to the flitch level. The aim of this project is to generate a long-term schedule with 36 time periods by maximizing the profit of the project while satisfying all mining and processing capacity constraints. Click the Optimizer menu, select Options and then click the Time Periods submenu to specify the time periods for the optimization. To add variable optimization periods, click the Edit in Advanced mode. Change the start time period to show the 1st to 7th 2013 and then enter the value 36 into the Number of Time Periods field. This will generate 36 time periods. Under the Constraints tab we have specified maximum milling and maximum truck hours. Click the Options submenu to select the optimization strategy from the three available options. Tick the sliding window scheduling option. By default, the 2 plus 1 option is selected. This means that two time periods are optimized at once. After completing an optimization phase, the results for the first time period is kept and the window is moved forward by one time period to optimize the next two time periods. The process repeats until the schedule for the last time period is found. Confirm that the Reset Rates to Defaults option is ticked. This option will replace any manually added activity rates with the default rate which has been set for the activity type. Select the attribute Profit from the Value drop-down menu. By doing so, iGantt Optimizer will optimize the schedule by maximizing the profit of the project. Click the Optimizer menu and then click Optimize. This will open up an Optimize window showing the first and last periods to optimize. The dates of the first and last time periods flow through from the time periods submenu set up previously. Click the Optimize button. This will activate the optimization showing a dialog window with the progress. The iGantt Optimizer uses a mixed integer linear programming model to represent the mine and its production constraints using a branch and bound algorithm. It looks for all possible feasible solutions that will satisfy the defined constraints and select the one with the greatest net present value. When the best solution is found, the dialog box disappears. Analyze the results in the summary report that shows values of all the report items per time period. Click the visualization menu and then select view schedule to validate the schedule using an animation. Tick the show remaining tick box to step through the remaining reserve. Select the viewing data of the 1st to the 7th 2013. Select the time interval of 256 milliseconds and then click the run button. The animation steps through the schedule of load and haul activities showing the decrease in the reserve. This tutorial has shown you the necessary steps to develop a long-term schedule using the iGantt optimizer.